He stands for truth, justice, and the American way. Hey, everyone, this is Digital Charcuterie. Thanks for stepping by. If you're new here, click the subscribe button. We're a uh, charcuterie board of digital content. And if you like the video, feel free to Hulk smash the like button. Superman Legacy is a little-known film coming out in a, in a couple years, actually two years in July. Exciting times ahead. They are on the verge of casting Superman Lois Lex the authority, Swamp Thing maybe, everyone is gonna be in this. And some new intriguing details are coming out based on the Hollywood Reporter, a little article on James Gunn and the work finding Superman, the perfect Superman. This is a, an actor who has to play this role for at least a decade, maybe longer, ask Robert Downey Jr. They have to be the face. And so the search is a difficult one. They've taken their time. It's been months of of screen of auditions and now screen tests and costume as Clark Kent and Superman. They gotta have the perfect balance of both. I trust the process, you should too. Uh, I mean, if it fails, it fails and whatever. But details are coming in on the plot now and they're saying that this Superman legacy film actually takes place in a world that is filled with superheroes and this should come as no surprise because we know that Blue Beetle is the first character in the DCU that we are introduced to. And through Blue Beetle, we also are aware of Batman. Batman exists in Blue Beetle, therefore Batman exists in Superman Legacy. Other superheroes exist? We are not sure yet, but the authority obviously uh, due to some capacity and creature commandos do as well. How that plays a factor in this Superman film intrigues me the most because one thing I really liked about Man of Steel was the the alien story, how an alien has to adapt to life on Earth, how an alien is human, and then how humans view that alien. Now, this is the complete reverse of that, right? We already have aliens. These things already exist. So how does Superman incorporate himself into this world? After being here for all these years, seeing all these other heroes around, what sparks him? Is it just the Fortress of Solitude? Is it a combination? How are they going to work Superman becoming this in? And are we going to get the Justice Society as well, of everyone's favorite part of Black Adam. Obviously, that would be a full recast. I don't think that's going to happen. I think the authority is what's going to take over for that for now. It's looking like it's going to be a lot of fun. I'm very optimistic on this. James Gunn uh, has a proven track record. You can say Suicide Squad, The Suicide Squad failed all you want. Uh, that was in a different time period, a very awkward one for film going as well. Uh, we'll see. Still no word on if Wonder Woman's going to exist in this or not. And, uh, of course, Supergirl. They're going to recast Supergirl, or will she remain the same? I can't wait to hear. We should find out within a month who the leads of Superman Legacy are. I can't wait. Let me know what you guys think of all of this in the comments down below. And until next time, may you be the master of your own universe. And don't forget to like and subscribe.